Hey guys, what's going on? It's OSS here with Gadget Hacks, and I'm going to be showing you how to roll back your Tinder update back to when it wasn't shitty. So here on the left on my iPhone, we have the newest Tinder update, which includes um, perks, I guess, like Rewind, which of course you have to pay for, and um, changing your location. So you can change your location with this passport feature, but again, in order to do that, you have to pay $9.99 a month if you're under the age of 30, which is absolutely ridiculous, or $19.99 a month if you're over the age of 30. And they do this because, one, people over the age of 30 looking for love are willing to pay more, and they have more money. At least that's pretty much what their communications person said. So here on the Android, um, you can see that the older version does not have either of those features, and um, there shouldn't be a swipe limit. They said they've imposed a swipe limit on the newest update. It'll only come into play for a very, very, very small portion of users, but nonetheless, there is a limit. Some may reach it, most of you won't. So if you want to roll back to the good old version, all you need to do is download the APK, which I've provided in the description and the full article on Gadget Hacks. And once you have that, we're going to hop out here, and I'll just show you exactly what you do. You can either download it straight to your phone. Here I have it in my files. Right here, Tinder 3.32, I'll just tap on that. It'll of course take me here, I'll hit install, install, next, etc. And once I do that, I can of course go back into my Tinder app and it'll log into the Facebook account that's associated with my Tinder. So I won't need to enter in my information anymore. And that's really the basic gist of it. You can see here, it does look different. The interface is a little bit different. I don't have those bonus features and I can just enjoy my Tinder the way I used to. No need for paying $9.99. I don't even have to deal with it. So again, you can roll back to 3.3.2, no problem, on your Android device. So make sure to check out the full article for more information on why they changed this and how you can, of course, roll back. And I'll make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys.